hello welcome back in this short video we are going to learn about how to enroll corporate own device in admin center first of all we need to know about enrollment process uh, how many types of enrollment process in uh, using a corporate basically mm, there are four types of enrollment process using a corporate like uh, token qr google zero touch and most of the company is using uh, Google Zero Touch is the most powerful so it's uh, uh, most of the corporate uh, companies are using G Google Zero Touch to configure and integrate with Microsoft it, uh, admin center uh, in our case today we are going to use uh, token for enrolling the corporate owned device so this is a admin center just click on devices click on enrollment devices and click on Android enrollment here you, you can see here like uh, uh, four types of enrollment profile personal owned devices corporate owned devices dedicate uh, and uh, corporate owned fully managed manage and uh, fourth one is a corporate owned device with work profile so today we are going to create a corporate own device with per profile first we need to uh, need to in uh, create the profile just uh, like uh, i'm again so uh, click on devices enrollment click on android enrollment and click on corporate own device with work profile Click on create a profile or just copy the meaningful name. Oh, sorry, sorry. Um, wait. Devices, enrollment, Android, corporate. Copy the meaningful. Click on create profile. Create. next create mm, just we have enabled the corporate own profile corporate own device with work profile so we need to enable the token just click on uh, profile properties here token this is a token you can share with uh, site it's or uh, users uh, users for enrolling the machine so just we have uh, enabled the profile and also we defined the uh, what is the requirement of token uh, like you have shared the token with uh, user and user will uh, uh, suppose user have a reset factory reset or company own new phone so user can access the qr code and machine will automatically uh, move to uh, enrollment process uh, 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 we have just cover the first step now second step is uh, we need to first how we can go goes to associate the upcoming devices L suppose a company have um, purchased uh, thousand devices so how you can associate all thousand devices uh, for the corporate own device with work profile so we need to create a dynamic group first we need to create the profile then we need to create a dynamic group just to copy the for profile name for your reference click on groups basically it is the azure group so you can create from uh, azure portal or so you can also create from here click on new group a group type as security enter the meaningful name and membership as device dynamic device just you can rename like as a dynamic dynamic oh sorry dynamic group okay 
add query so we have uh, like uh, identify the prof like we have filter the using the profile name like uh, there are lots of option you can enroll the uh, manufacturing also you can define the but we are using the enrollment profile and um, operator as equal value as basically we why we are entered here because we have created uh, this this is a unique name or uh, profile unique name so if any device uh, enrollment using this profile these device will come automatically in Side the dynamic group so that's we have associated let's click another now it's created so uh, second step we have done create the dynamic group it's time to create the profile like uh, click on devices uh, enrollment devices uh, my my mouse is enrollment devices so click on Android first we need to configure the profile just click on create a profile and select the platform as device Android enterprise here we are creating the profile like uh, fully managed corporate owned profile and now it's time we not uh, working as the personal owned profile so we have just create a one profile basic profile create the profile here and enter the name work profile next so we have uh, in this we have like uh, there are it's a very lots of uh, option you can use to create the as for your requirement or client requirement you like we have just work using for work profile not just to be work profile password defined as the names and and uh, number of days we can define as a 45 days numeric six define the length and also we can use some like uh, uh, personal google account disable basically we have uh, uh, cover the basic thing because it uh, it's totally depend on you how to configure how what is the requirement so here is a time to assignment so we have already created the group Click on next. Now we have uh, created the uh, profile, and last step we need to create the compliance profile. Click on Android here. Basically, if we are not created, then it will be using to inbuilt compliance profile for enrollment like uh, it's a um, device is compliance or not so we have just created the basic profile here select the platform enterprise fully managed we can copy fully managed next like uh, device property we have defined the version like uh, 11 minimum and also we can define as per your requirement you can define the requirement basically we have like just we have if this uh, uh, this requirement match then device make as the compliance otherwise it's non compliant next here is the option you can uh, uh, like uh, how many days 
and also you have option to send the notification users or there is option it's very useful uh, if you required so you can useful uh, just we have skipped this because this is my live environment next now is the assignment we have using the same group next yeah, created so like basically in this short video we have uh, uh, using to create the what is the requirement and what are the uh, prerequisite for uh, creating creating corporate own device with work profile first we need to create uh, enable the uh, corporate own profile then we need to create a dynamic group to associate the uh, upcoming uh, devices and uh, then we create create the profile enroll um, configuration profile then we need to create basically there are basic four steps so in this short video we have covered like how to in enroll corporate own device thank you